Good day, boys and girls. Welcome to our mathematics lesson. Our topic for today is decompose and divide. Listen carefully. Decompose. To decompose means to break a number down into individual place values. For example, 479 is equal to 400 plus 70 plus 9. Our hundreds are in red, our tens are in blue, and our units are in green. Let's look at what it means to divide. To divide means to share equally. Now let's look at the sum so that we can understand the operation of division better. 18 divided by 3 is equal to 6. Pay attention to the shape of the division sign. The first number, 18, is the dividend. It is also the largest number. The second number is 3, which is the divisor, and always goes together with the division sign. And the last number is the answer to a division sum or quotient. What does it mean to divide, boys and girls? It means to share equally. 18 is shared equally into three groups. In each of the groups, we have six. When we take 18 and share it equally between the three groups, we find that in each group, we have six objects. So 18 minus 6 minus 6 minus 6 will give you 0 because you have shared all 18 objects out equally and you have nothing left. And in each group, you find that you have 6 objects. So 18 divided by 3 is equal to 6. How does decomposing help you to divide? Decomposing a number into its individual place values helps us to divide it more easily because you are working with smaller numbers. For example, 28 divided by 2 equal to 14. Firstly, you're going to decompose 28 to give you 20 plus 8 divided by 2. Your 10 will be divided by 2 and your unit will be divided by 2. 20 divided by 2 plus 8 divided by 2. 20 divided by 2 is 10 because there are 10 twos in 20. If we count in twos, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, you will find that there are 10 twos in 20. Plus 8 divided by 2. If we count in twos until you come to 8, you will find that you have 4 twos. 2, 4, 6, 8. Your two answers, 10 and 4, are added together to give your final answer. 10 plus 4 is 14. Now let's look at steps in detail. 28 divided by 2 equal to 14. Step number 1. Decompose the dividend into its individual place value groups. 20 plus 8 divided by 2. Step number 2. Divide each number by the divisor. 20 divided by 2 plus 8 divided by 2. Step number 3. Work out the sums within the groups. 20 divided by 2 is 10 plus 8 divided by 2 is 4. Add both numbers together to get the answer or quotient. 10 plus 4 is equal to 14. So 28 divided by 2 is equal to 14. Let's look at more examples, boys and girls. 36 divided by 3 is equal to 12. 30 plus 6 divided by 3. 36 is decomposed into 30 plus 6. 
Your 10 is divided by 3 plus your unit is divided by 3. 30 divided by 3 plus 6 divided by 3. 30 divided by 3 is 10. 6 divided by 3 is 2. Both the numbers are added together to give you your final answer. 10 plus 2 is equal to 12. Let's look at the next example. 45 divided by 5 is equal to 9. 45 is decomposed into 40 plus 5 divided by 5. 40 divided by 5 plus 5 divided by 5. Now let's work out the sums within the brackets. 40 divided by 5 is 8 and 5 divided by 5 is 1. Both answers are added together to give you a final answer. 8 plus 1 is 9. So 45 divided by 5 is equal to 9. Remember boys and girls to always check your answers to make sure they are correct. It's a good time, boys and girls, to start building your division tables. 